It's already looking like costume wig to me, but. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Just Naughty and today I have for you guys another wig video. This wig was sent to me by YMS Girl. Now this wig is a little bit different than any other wig that I've worn on my channel. The color is actually a color that I've never tried before. Well, it's a color that I've never reviewed for you guys before. So this is the bag that the wig came in. Inside it has a wig cap, two of them. And there's this card with their information on it. It tells you a little bit about their company and how you guys can reach them. This wig is eight inches and it's in the strawberry color. It's a bob as you guys can see. I've never worn a color as vibrant as this, but I've had something a little bit similar to it, but the, the roots was a little bit tinted. So if I don't like the way this looks after I flat iron it, cause it's gonna need a little bit of um, flattening. After I flat iron this, if I don't like the way it looks, I did get some root touch up for me to apply to the root. I'm gonna show you guys how this look on me first before I play with it. All right. So this is what I'm working with under here. Let me get a bobby pin real quick. Give me one second. Okay, so I just want this to be as flat as possible, so I'm just going to try my best to tuck all this hair in. I'm not gonna wear uh, I'm not gonna wear the wig cap that came with it because this only has lace on the middle, so I think I'll be fine. I'm gonna show you guys the construction of the wig. It does have lace only in the middle. There's no lace in the back. This wig comes with three combs. There's one in the back and one on each side. There isn't one in the middle, of course, because the lace is up there. But there's nothing else to this. This wig does not, oh, it does. This wig also have these elastic bands on the side that you guys can adjust to your tightness. I'm not gonna really put it on tight. I think I'm just gonna put it onto the first one because I don't want it to squeeze my head. I don't want it to squeeze my head. I'm sure it's gonna fit right, but let me try it on first. So I just left the adjust to the first piece. I'm not gonna tighten it or anything, only if need be. All right, so let's put this on. Let's put this on. It fit good, it's not small. Um, it's already looking like costume wig to me, but. <laughs> Okay, let me go ahead and put this on my mannequin head and start flat ironing it. spiking glue to lay down the front of my hair. I'm only gonna put it up here because the rest of this isn't really gonna show or it's, it's not really gonna show um, after I put the wig on. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna add some more glue to this area right here so that I can put the wig on top of it. Now the only reason I'm using this glue is because I'm not gonna leave this wig on. So I'm not gonna put no ghost bond or whatever it's called on my hair because I know the wig's not gonna stay on my head. So I'm gonna stick to the good old gossip. This is my first time using the the um the hair gel to glue down the, the lace. I normally do the spray. All right, I'm gonna let that dry a little bit. And So y'all, yeah, I thought I bought some root touch up, but I didn't. I bought some temporary hair color spray for men. Their beard. <laughs> oh, it does say for root touch up right there. Never mind, I'm slow. This is my first time using this, so wish me luck, you guys. I don't want my. I think I'm gonna put this over here because I don't want my um my part to be black. After I apply the root touch up, um, the root touch up was a little bit messy and it was a little tricky to put on at first, but um, I think I applied it well. Um, I try not to put it too much in the same spot, but um, I think it blended well. Um, my hair is still flowing, so it didn't stiffen up my hair. Um, I did forget to apply some foundation or concealer. I did end up adding edges to me. It made the unit look a little bit better. As you guys can tell, the hair moves freely. It's not stiff at all. And the root touch up did do a good job. I actually like it better than before. And as you guys can tell, I'm feeling this hair. Like it looks good on me. I like the length. And this color isn't really my go-to, but I think because I added that pinch of black to the roots, it kind of helped. But let me know what you guys think about this wig. Um, was it a 
Yes and no. Is there a color that you guys would like for me to try? The link for this unit will be down below. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and leave it in my comment section. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video.